Well, hello, Argo. He's not even going to look at me. He wants to sniff that. Don't you, dog? You want to show him what you found? It's kind of hard to miss. Let's go. So, <laughs> actually, let me zoom in right here. We have here the footer, Edwin H. Gott. And they are tied up. And I think the Manitoulin is leaving the lock right now. A little pan. There's lots of stuff in the way here, unfortunately. And we got some geese here. And then, of course, we have Spud up here doing what Spud does best, keeping an eye on everything, making sure everything is going smooth. Yep, Spud's the man. And if I can do this, ooh, trying to not make anyone sick. Oh, it's a fast pan, I'm sorry. Oh, I gotta have my phone and arms stuck through the bars here of this fence. You can see, I think it's the Manitoulin. We'll find out here in a few moments. And the Gott, I don't know if you noticed earlier, they're not tied up, they're just creeping in. I can see that they are indeed moving. see who this is while we wait today is the 16th of may thursday the 16th of may 2024 and of course i'm here in lovely springtime sault st marie michigan and those hills you see in the distance there well that's canada over there uh, just just the river between <laughs> the uh, Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan and Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario, Canada. Hey, look at that. I was right. Manitoulin. There we go. They are beaten feet, that's for sure. That applies to uh, ships. We'll get them here. Passing the gut. Um, earlier today, Stubby came through. And uh, I did not get to see them. Because <laughs> I was well, I was working. Whoop, Argo's pulling on me. So it was good to see the Stuart J. Court. If only through the uh, <laughs> Streamtime Live camera. But maybe, just maybe I can catch them on the return trip. Um, but this was Stubby's first trip out from their uh, winter layup. And they had to get, you know, their, I don't know if it's every five year inspection and new paint and all that done. So this, this is a double. The God is moving and the Manitoulin is really moving. So this definitely counts as a twofer. I don't know if you can see, it's kind of cloudy. Um, I think there is rain predicted for tonight. But right now it's like mid 60s, slight breeze. Just need a t-shirt, it's quite comfortable. And as I mentioned Canada there, that tower you see in the background and all that, that's Canada on the other side of the got.
There you go, Manitoulin wasting no time. Okay. If I had to pick a favorite footer, I think it would be the Edwin H. Gott. Let's go, dog. Because they have the most horsepower on the Great Lakes here. And they just seem to always go <laughs> without problem. They can just go, 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 turn and burn all season long. Hope I didn't just jinx them by saying that. So, so yeah, if I had to pick a favorite footer, I think it'd be the GOT. There we go. But <laughs> that's going to do it for now. I'll give the view here as I walk. I'm going to finish up the walk. And then I have to go do my grocery shopping. And then, of course, Argo and I both need dinner after that. So, really quick, that sign right there. That's why you never see me down there <laughs> in Fort Brady Park. Ah, oh, that blasted sign. So, anyway, have a fantastic day. I'm sure you're also staying warm. We're kind of in that season where it's a pretty safe bet most of the time. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Argo and I will be back very soon. Right, dog?